Hey YouTube, what's up? It's KZDN. Welcome back to more Resident Evil. Remake HD. Super duper. Uh, 18? Damn. <laughs> Episode 18. This game's longer than I thought. Uh, as we left off, we kept exploring the laboratory. The laboratory. Uh, found out some... That those weird fly creatures that I thought were originally from 4. Apparently they were in this game. And maybe the remake added them. I'm not sure. But F those goddamn things. Uh, the five also had them. <laughs> now that I remember. At least these ones don't go invisible, thank god. Uh, there's still that room, I have no idea. There's, but I'm missing things in both those rooms and I can't figure out what to do. Uh, pretty much solved all the other puzzles. Except for the Mo disc thing. I don't know what to do with that. And I need to go through this door. Maybe this door will have an answer, I don't know. I forgot to show my inventory. I put all my pistol bullets with me. I about... <laughs> Oh God, I'm starting to run low on, yep, this is some giant ass room or something. Can I go straight through here? Oh, I can. Um, I'm running low on shotgun. Oh God. Oh, of course you just ignore everything. Oh, and they get low and you have to duck down to shoot them. At least the range. How many shots did it take? Oh, nice, I can shoot them down. Oh, it takes, it takes like almost a clip. Almost a clip to kill them. And they hurt. They hurt. I only have one healing item with me. Uh, hopefully there's not that many of them. Can't tell if that was a dying thing or if there is more in here. There's probably more in here, isn't there? Oh, God, there's one of them. Uh. Oh, God. Did I shoot him down? Nope, he just jumped down. I'm gonna stun lock like this. Looks pretty good for me. <laughs> Did I kill him? Oh, nice. Are, they, are these giant ticks? Oh god, I thought another one just jumped at me. This place sucks. Check my inventory. A map, I mean. So there's a door over here. Uh, oh, and this loops around this way. My, my. Okay, it just goes in a big circle. Oh god, I hear another one. How many are how many of these things are there? Oh, there's one right there. <laughs> just take it. What the, they just got straight back down? That's not fair. I was about to say, how am I not be able to shoot you? Okay, that one that one was stupid, he just took it. <laughs> I mean he did go up for a second, but then just jumped straight back down. I guess I guess technically he made me waste an extra bullet, so that's Good on him. What is this? Warning, fuel may explode if shaken or jarred. Oh god, another one of these signs. A refueling device for the power room. It's not working right now because there's no fuel. The empty capsule. Oh! <laughs> Looks like a torpedo anal... Never mind. Um, take the fuel supply capsule? Sure. So that's what I'm supposed to do. So now I need to go back to the other room... I need to go all the way back, refuel it, and come back here? That sucks. You know what? I'm just gonna... I'm gonna keep powering through. You get to a point sometimes where you just gotta power through. And that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I'm gonna go all the way to the end of these rooms, because I know I'm gonna have to come back here anyway, so I might as well finish exploring. Oh god, I hear more of them. And it's a red room. Oh, it's fine! Oh, what?! Why did it just explode? I got, I got I popped its head off or something? <laughs> it just exploded. What is this? A security system passcode transmission device. If you had, oh my god. So there is gonna be. Holy shit! There is gonna be three of them. What the hell? Am I? In... Uh, I must be at some kind of angle. Please be dead. Oh god. <laughs> I stopped to scratch my arm, and it just jumped out at me. Goddamn evil thing. Okay, good thing I decided to carry all my pistol bullets with me, because I would have been going through a lot of shotgun shells. Otherwise... Oh, there's a taser here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, that just gave him a free hit on my back. How bad am I hurt? Pretty bad. Pretty bad. I'm just gonna use this. 
Oh god, they grabbed me. No, 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 no. Oh. Oh, I can straight up dagger him from there. I'm gonna shoot the shit out of you. Is he like holding his head? Oh god, that's a good angle of that. <laughs> well, I have one dagger left. Well, okay, so they do. They're gonna. They, if I walk under them, they will just grab me and try to execute me. Ah, oh, damn it. Um. Hi. Right, I think he's dead. Did get one hit on me. Only bad thing about the pistol is not much stopping power. And all the way down to two clips already. I had 60 extra bullets, I think. Uh. So now I know I need to come down here with the fuel and a mo disc. And I need to find another one of those transceiver things. <laughs> Why is there so many of these bug creatures? Fucking suck. Oh god. I heard at least two or something. Holy shit! Okay, that one like ran away from me. It says I'm. I noticed that it does auto lock on just by holding the trigger. Oh god, it just ignored me. Nice. Okay, that one's dead. Is there another one? Oh, I can definitely hear another one. Is it coming at me? I can hear it, but I don't... I can... Yeah, I can definitely hear it. Oh god, it's behind me! Come on! Oh, god damn it. Oh, is, oh, is there more? Oh, good thing that lock on works so well. Because <laughs> I was not aiming at that thing. There is definitely at least one more. And I am in red caution. Nine bullets should be enough. But I'm worried about it running up and killing me. Uh, what is this? Ooh, this is... This, I found the self-destruct mechanism. It's huge. Where the hell is this last guy? Is he behind me? Fuck, what the fuck, what the fuck? He's chasing me. Get away. Get away. What the hell? He just ran right past me. <laughs> I blew his head off from behind. I will take it. Oh my god, I went through all my pistol bullets, basically. And three shotgun shells. This freaking place was horrible. Hopefully they stay dead. Oh wait, is this something? Uh, there's no power to the main elevator. Start it up? Yes. Won't initialize. Appears to need some kind of fuel. Okay, so I think I need to get... I need to heal myself, first of all. And I need to bring a modus down here. I need to refuel that capsule thing. The capsule thing says... Well, it's a good thing I cleared out all the zombies. And all these bugs, I guess. Because that thing says, like, it'll blow up or whatever if you, if you get damaged or move too fast, shaken, or stirred. <laughs> uh, so I guess that's kind of a way it makes you want to kill every zombie in this area then, doesn't it? Alright, so I need to go heal myself, get a modisc, go refuel the capsule, come all the way back down here, use the modisc, use the capsule, turn the elevator on, which maybe will get me the last thing. I think. Wait, where do I need? I wanted to go through this door. So I don't have to go all the way back up. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. It's a good thing I have lots of... Ran right past the chest. Good thing I have lots of healing items, at least. Alright, so... I'll just use a first aid. Is there anything else I want to grab with me? I definitely want a mo disc. Look at all these healing items I have. I still have this self-defense gun. I think it's just a, like a magnet with one shot. That seems to be what it is. And I will also take uh, another mixed herb because I'm going to heal myself and have an extra healing item with me. All right. I am down to nine bullets though. I think I have one dagger and seven. But it looks like I filled out all that stuff I don't know maybe someone told me I don't know <laughs> I, just, I went in the room looked around I thought I have a couple ideas of what might be it maybe it's just like a dagger or something hidden in a way I can't see it 
and that's what it is. Okay, so I need to go through here, and then the second door. First door is x-ray door. Just gotta ignore that, and I should be fine. So, I know where at least two of the Modisk things are. And I guess I should carry a third one with me. Oh, those cockroaches still scare me. Uh, so this is what I need to do. Looks like refueling device set the capsule into it. Yes. And it does this whole little thing here. You got the fuel supply capsule. Main ingredient of the fuel appears to be nitro compound. Running could result in fatal explosion. Um, if that's true, I'm going to be using the tank controls then. Because it the game automatically runs if I like just hold up on the analog stick too much. So that could be very dangerous, but I'm not good at turning. Yeah, and then with the classic controls you have to like hold up and then Oh god, you have to walk your way all the way through here. Yeah, so if you left all those zombies alive, this could be pretty, pretty annoying. Oh my god, I left all those bugs alive. Um. Uh, I guess, no, I want to turn. Yeah, that's right, you can't just turn it all the way. So be very careful not to effing run. <laughs> I've never moved this slow in this game. So I... I wonder why the lim what, what the limitations were, because I get apparent they had to run right. You'd have to hold a button to run, though. I don't know. <laughs> I guess the way the game was back then. And hold up. Don't. Oh, I was about to hold B. Remove my thumb from that angle. Walking down the stairs now, very very gently. I was like, she looks down. Where her feet are. That's actually a nice little touch. I don't know if that's just her. Because of the model going. Or if they actually program that. Because that's actually a nice little touch. Oh, yeah, I need to go through here. I'm trying to remember where I need to go to refuel that thing. It's in here, isn't it? Isn't it like right over here? Uh, Or is it in the next room? The next room is the Mo Disc, right? I think I just need to go around. God damn it. Uh, is it this way? Yeah, I think it's around this corner. <laughs> oh god, I kind of want to see what happens if I do run with it. Yeah, I do that little, this little bonus thing or something. So I need to put the power module in here. And use you. Are you fucking serious? Effing serious. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? A fuel supply device is for the power room. It's not working right now because there's no fuel. Set what? what? Whatever. It just it changed the rules of the game. Fuel seems to have been supplied. Okay then. Now I can run again. <laughs> Fucking nitros. I still remember uh what was it? Every time Nitro comes up, I think of, like, Crash Crash Bandicoot, and for some reason, Ricky, Richie Rich, Ricky Rich, Richie Rich, it's just the, the his dad using the Smellulator, whatever the hell the thing was, and Nitro Conglycerate or some shit like that, what, isn't that in TNT? Oh my god, it's a bomb! So I need to use this thing now. There's no power to the main elevator. Oh. Hey. Oh god. Am I supposed to do the self-destruct thing? This could be really bad for me, couldn't it? Lab self-destruct mechanism is huge. Nope, I guess not. Maybe I need to come back to this elevator later. Or elevator. Uh, door later? Oh, I just realized I skipped the whole Modis thing, too. <laughs> Holy crap. The way my brain works is pretty shocking. Um, Let's go this way. Here we go. Modis time. 
use you. I guess I need to. I should pick up the third bow disc on my way to the elevator. Transmitting the passcode seems to have unlocked something. Well, it's two out of three. I'm probably gonna have to. I don't know. I don't even know what I'm hell I'm gonna need to do. I also kind of see go back to that berry thing and see what happens if I don't give him his pistol. Uh, back this way. Get the get the thing. I'll bring. I have a full heal. I'll bring a grenade. Grenade rounds. What kind though? I have flame, explosive. I'll bring I'll bring the flame. Rounds. And I have a bunch of acid rounds also. I keep doing that. Uh, so give me a mo disc. I still have the magnum. That I'm stacked. <laughs> I am ready for whatever comes. Hopefully there's not an achievement in this game for getting 100% of all the items and stuff. Because if I missed it by just those two... Oh god, wrong thing. Those two herbs I left downstairs. Yes, press it. I'll be quite upset. Something gonna come out of the elevator. Elevator's working. Jill! Oh shit, Barry. Barry! You could have at least waited up for me, you know? Let's go. No. 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 Not one. Remember the whole thing we had about like explaining and whatnot? I, oh, oh. I guess we have to accept it for now. And Barry's with me. Oh, I found, instantly found shotgun shells. I'll take it. I didn't even see them. Oh crap! I went to talk to Barry and accidentally went inside. Ah, oh, I'm gonna have to ride it back up too. Well, at least we get this nice, beautiful. Where's the elevator music? Uh, back up. <laughs> God damn it! One thing I wish you could have skipped. Like I can understand the doors and the atmosphere and everything, but I mean, come on. There's Barry. Okay, now I'll talk to him. And I can't talk to him. Okay, then. Where the hell are we? Nothing this way. So we're going this way. Are we going to get some answers here? Oh, it's got the biohazard symbol. Ooh, super advanced doors. Wesker. Wesker! Mm-hmm. Thank you, Barry. Well, what do you know? Oh, don't blame Barry for everything. I hear that his better half and two lovely daughters will be in danger if he doesn't do everything I tell him to. Yep. <sighs> Figured. Wesker, you're pathetic. Well, you shouldn't worry too much, dear. You'll be free of all this anyway. Why eliminate stars? Believe it or not, that's Umbrella's intention. <sighs> You're just a slave of Umbrella. Smart girl. But I think you misunderstand me. The things you mention are nothing. I'll burn all of them along with this entire laboratory. Barry, go up on the ground and wait there. Barry? <laughs> you gotta love Barry. He must really be afraid of Umbrella. You and Umbrella took his family, you bastard. Oh! <laughs> Freaking sound effect. Umbrella? Well, I used some carrots and sticks to cow him, but it had nothing to do with Umbrella. I just used Barry for my personal interests. Though both you and Barry seem to think I was following Umbrella's orders. What? What are you planning? I guess it's time for show and tell. So is he? In, he's not infected with the virus yet, right? Or is he? That, that's tyrant, right? Oh god. Because we all know what happens to Wesker. He becomes the most badass thing ever. That's why I'm really wondering what Resident Evil 6 is all about. Because 
pretty much five ends the series. Oh god. No, Mr. Tyrant. Oh, at least I brought my flame. It's magnificent. For the sake of this thing. You know, I hate goodbyes. Oh! Uh. Barry comes in for the save. Barry! I want to forgive me. No, you're not to blame. It's Umbrella and Wesker. Even if it meant my family, I couldn't bear turning my back on my friends again. Oh, God! Shit! Did he release it? Oh, it's too late now, Barry. You effed up. So, was it Barry that killed Enrique? Enrico, or is it still Wesker? Okay, I think it's Enrique. Oh, God, it must be open. I was not prepared to fight this thing right now. Damn it! <laughs> Jill and Barry together in hell. Oh, big. You want a piece of me? Oh, wait. Oh, you got the heart. What? Like... Premature. <laughs> I mean, just, oops, why would you walk up to it? Just shoot it. You got a big bag. No, Barry! <laughs> you viral cultured freak. Uh. We're gonna fight it in here? Oh, God. So I wonder. Oh, Lordy Lord. Hmm. At least I brought extra. I would have brought the Magnum. If I would have known this was gonna happen. Is there any environmental type things I can do? Number of capsules each containing an unspeakably ugly creature. Oh, I can't run around this way. Uh oh. Oh, oh he, he's aggressive. Wait, that did not. It only put me in yellow? Jesus. And. Ah. Oh, oh, Jesus. Oh. I, I'm try, trying to figure out where to go. There we go. Oh, he's a big one. Oh, I missed. How was that? It's pretty funny. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Oh, it's not look good for me, everybody. It's not look good for me. Find you, you. Walk around here. You're pathetic. <laughs> He's holding something. I'm just gonna read this note, I guess, while the tyrant is just gonna wait. Very, very polite. The discovery of the G virus was in fact 21 years after the administration of the prom. prom Primogenitor virus. Is that what the one in Veronica uses? She uses some kind of genitor. No, it's, that's actually the. It's named after her or something, isn't it? The prototype parasite, which we had delivered from a laboratory in France. I can't tell. Obviously, I don't know if this retroactive or if this is all part of it. But if it. A prototype parasite, which we had delivered from a laboratory in France. Resident Evil 4, it's all about the Los Plagas, which was like an ancient thing they found in fossils or whatever that was like in undisclosed Europe which was probably like um one of them countries near France Spain probably uh so this would make all connected all how this all started they actually it actually resonated before it was the birthplace of it all kind of <laughs> uh, sample specimen this sample specimen took in the parasite without showing any signs of adverse reaction the lack of any reaction was an unsolved mystery, but now everything is clear to me now. Okay. The prototype parasite was incubating in the sample specimen's body for 21 years. Then from that incubating state, the prototype suddenly mutated. Evolved may be a more appropriate word to describe it. This observation gave me more insight into my research. Though uh, th through further modification and testing, I was able to derive... A method to create the G that surpasses the performance of the T. This was breakthrough that would change the future of the BOW's history. I can't wait to see a look on Alexia's annoying face when I finally announce my Alexia. Um, knowing face when I finally announce my research, but unfortunately I'll have to wait a few more years to completely verify my findings. William Birkin. Birkin? Why do I know that name? Oh, crap. I... I don't know what to do. Barry? No time for that. Did that hit him? I don't even know. 
Doesn't look good for me, everybody. It's not looking for me. Oh. Looks good for me, everybody. I did it. I did it, everybody. <laughs> That's like no time to deal with Barry, but I had time to like pick up a note and read it from Wesker. Uh, so I can go all the way down this end. I'm on the other side of this now. Panel used to release emergency electronic lock. Lock has been released. What lock did I just... What, what lock did I just unlock? Huh? Now I'm confused. Is there a MODIS thing in here? A machine used to compile experimental data. Used to compile experimental data. A lot of data. Nothing else in here. Nothing else in here. Talk to Barry. Barry! Barry! <sighs> uh, you're okay. <sighs> Jill. Sorry. That was careless of me. Wesker. He's gone. Oh, God. First, let's just get out of here. <sighs> okay. He has his magnum. A big dead guy right here. Let's just walk past him. Did I get everything in this room? Uh, appears so. Looks like we're just gonna get on out of here then. Yeah, so... I like how he just Wesker like, premature! Bah! <laughs> what a doofus. Wesker must have set it off. Let's hurry! I was not expecting... I guess this is the finale then. I, I thought there would be more. <laughs> Still has to be on the damn elevator. Uh. So do I not need the third mode disc and all that shit? What the hell was that about? I guess the, like him running ahead or whatever. I'm so confused. Did I miss a huge thing with the mode disc? I don't wait. Where? What the hell am I even supposed to do? Um. Okay, I'm gonna go in here. Obviously, keep the modus thing. I don't. Did I miss? I might have missed where to put a modus or something. Okay, I don't need the pistol anymore. Place that with the magnum. With those magnum rounds. And then give me mixed herb. It's not a full heal. I don't. I don't. Uh, shotgun. I mean, all the magnum bullets there is gonna be perfectly fine, right? To, all personnel must evacuate. I was just listening. Um, give me grenade shells. Three flame, six grenades. Nine acid. Okay, I'm cock locked and ready to rock. What do I do though? <laughs> Still only found two modus things. I don't know where to go. What to do. I thought maybe I go back to the self destruct. So that means Wesker got out, ran all the way through that, and got to the self destruct thing. Oh god! Let me time to start running past shit now. Uh, I don't even know. I guess I need to run all the way back to the... I guess I need to run back to the self-destruct thing. I guess I need to deactivate that thing. I'm gonna f flip that switch now. I don't... It's locked. If you could just get those levers on the side to work. I don't know what the last... I have the last mode disc. I don't know where to put it, though. Obviously, this <laughs> I missed it. It's somewhere in my face. Where could it be? Though? Okay, so I need to go deactivate the self-destruct, I guess. But I figured I want that. I figured I'd want to go through that door also. I must. Where the hell do I go? Maybe in that room there is a modus thing that I did not see. No, but I got the key. I'm getting lost now. I think I need to go to the self-destruct thing. 
That's my only cue. I should walk around with a freaking grenade launcher. <laughs> Give me the shotgun. Uh, maybe it's in here. It still says there's something I didn't pick up. Either. <laughs> God damn it! It better not be in that other little mini. Uh, I could have sworn I've been looking all around. I didn't see nothing. Uh, nothing for that. Projector thing. If it, it would be in here, if there, if it wasn't here. Isn't that it right there? No. That's to play the stupid movie thing. Okay, it's not necessary to use that. Is that all that I can do here is play the movie thing? You can use the you can spill? No. Just double check, because I've been wrong. Nope. Uh, looks like I'm hitting the self-destruct thing. What the f How can I not know what to do? Filled there, it doesn't seem anything important. I don't, I don't get it. I'm missing all this stuff. Can I push this? It kind of looks like I can push it, doesn't it? Anything over here? Map? Oh god, there was a map in here? Where the hell is that? B1? B4? Wait. Oh! There was that... There was that thing all the way at the very top that was locked and I never figured out how to get in there, right? Where the hell is the elevator? I mean, the ladder to get back up, by the way. Uh, do I need to go... Just keep going back up? Or do I need to go all the way back down? There's that kerosene thing. <laughs> oh, God. I should have stuck with my gut and just went to the sell the detonation thing. Let's go up here and see if this is the right thing. Probably not. But I got nothing else. Oh, okay. hurry! Okay, maybe, maybe that what? Maybe this is right. What are we doing? Is going up to this door now? Well, I didn't open that door. You know, what the, you know what I think about it? That's probably where Chris is. Isn't it? Oh. This is Brad. I'm running out of fuel. If there's anyone alive, contact me now or just give me a sign. I repeat, this is your last chance. Oh. Oh, we got another cutscene with uh, Brad. I don't... Where do I use this last Mo disc? So I'm in this hallway. Nothing there. I, that door leads around to another locked door. It kind of looks like that door right there gets behind it. That was that elevator. Now I'm, I don't. I don't know. Maybe, maybe we'll find it over here. I don't know. Let's just keep moving. The hell are these? Can't carry any more items. What the hell? was that? Uh, nothing I can really do with the items I have. The hell were those? The elevator isn't receiving power. The fuse unit is missing. What? Is that really the fuse thing right here and I can't use it? Can I use this? I wasted a full heal, but okay then. Take the... <laughs> Why... Why is this a thing? It made me waste my freaking heal. I guess it's my fault for having things. Three minutes to detonation. Damn it! We're almost there! I'll go get him. You just get in contact with Brad. Whatever it takes. Okay. No, nope. elevator. Is there gonna be something on the elevator? No, nope. okay, it's just a good view. How the how could I not find the last book this thing? I feel like I'm skipping something very important. I have three minutes. I'm gonna have to go back and find it. Alright. Oh well, let's just finish the game like this for now. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> I thought that was part of the game. What the hell is this? 
take the signal rockets? Sure. How do I use them? Do I just use them? Uh, use? Oh, okay then. <laughs> this is, it's great that this was just here. Pew! Uh-oh. Hmm? Barry? Jill! Oh, it was Barry. You made it. It just buzzed through the floor. Oh god, it jumped up too. Oh god, bye Barry. Bye Barry. No, 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 Barry. Oh. Did I save him? Looks like I saved him. Oh god, I went big wipe on him. Unload on those shots. Okay, um. I like. I, I could just use the bag and I'm pretty sure I'll just fish them off, but. I'm just gonna unload everything I have. Oh god, I feel like it's gonna do a supercharge or something. Oh, it totally did. And it fucking launched me. I don't, I don't like this because I can't see. Oh, did I do it? Jill, use it! Kill it, whatever it is! Do I have to use that? Oh, Barry got his attention. Ah. Let me pick this up here. <laughs> use the rocket launcher. And it has four shots in it. Equip. And shoot! <laughs> I just stood there. And all the multiple angles. It just goes boom! Did I beat the game? I have well, a It's not over, right? What about Chris? Barry's old partner. What? Like, that's what I assume that's behind that locked door. Can you really just leave him behind? Is he gonna blow up? Oh! I feel the exact second it blew up, it switched to a, Your wife? the old game or something. Yeah, my wife and kids, they always wait up for me. <laughs> Even today, my eldest daughter. This is totally a Jurassic Park I ending, right? Not. It's okay. He's alive. Uh, I just know. You're talking about Chris? I don't think he would be alive if he was locked down in there, right? And we're going off into the sunset? Are you... <laughs> Resident Evil. <laughs> okay, we get a whole little cuts in here. Game part crew. Okay, then I'm going to cut ahead to see if uh, anything's at the very end here. And then I'm going to have to go and save Chris, or at least find out what the hell's behind that door. I assume it's Chris. Jill, you did a fine job. I did a fine job? Alpha Team's finest? Finish the game using Jill. I used 28 health items, I had 22 ribbons. Ooh, got a diamond achievement. Take that, zombies! Finish the game on the normal difficulty, or higher. Not that many people play this game, apparently. Oh, another trophy. Achievement. Not in the mood to die. Finish the game on easy difficulty or higher. So I guess I played on normal. Uh, I used 325 ammos. Taking candy from a baby. Very easy. Oh, nice. Video games that don't give you, like, rundown achievements, you know, for beating it on the lower difficulties are... I oh, got Mass Effect. Mass Effect! I had to play the game. I had to beat Mass Effect 1, like, seven times. Um, okay then, 325 ammo used, 100, I killed exactly 100 creatures, that's nice. Um, now play with features from the prototype version, real survivor mode, item boxes are no longer connected, meaning that items can only be taken out from there is started, 
Weapons aiming is manual. Oh shit, that's extremely difficult. Experience these prototype only features unavailable in the original Resident Evil. Jill has a new costume. You got the closet key. A new costume has been unlocked. You can change in the dressing room. Where's the dressing room at? All right. Cut to the game. I don't understand how this happened. There's three paths here that I did not notice. When I was going, I think I accidentally did find out the right thing to do. See, now this one goes to here. And this is what I kept doing all along. This is not the right path. I don't know. Is it? I could have. Yeah, this is the one. I could have sworn I went through here and thought I was, like, on the other side, which I am on the other side now. But I got completely confused. I never. I went in here one time, never checked it out. And here was the last. One of them. Is there also a battery on here? Oh, there is. There's stun walker. And security passcode system. Mo disk. Transmit. Okay. See, my inventory I just had the magnum in this. I'm just going full magnum now. I saved up all my ammo just for this one last thing. We have all switching. I did not go back. There is two things I'm still wondering about this game. One, if I do go back... Oh crap. If I do go back to the self-destruct system thing, if anything would happen. So now I can push this one this way. Okay, so then I could have just pushed that yeah, it was on the other side of that. So that whole thing of getting lost or in that room and not figuring it out. That's what it was the entire time. Um I still don't know what I'm missing. Not over here. In uh one of these other rooms. Whatever, B2, that one. I don't know what I'm missing over there. Uh, those bug things, sh there they are. They should still be chasing me. <laughs> Not dealing with them. I kept my shotgun just in case I needed to shoot one of them. I don't want to dignify them with a magnum shot. But, okay, so let's see what's... I assumed it, this has to do with Chris. Let's see if that's true or not. And this might also have to do with, um... Remember, oh no, up where Wesker was, I was like, electric magnet lock? I wonder what what the hell that just unlocked or whatever. Like, I might have gone through all this Modis thing and then still not have been able to get through here. Or at least, maybe the other door would also be locked or something. Because when I got the map, it was the map that was in the other room, that's right. I did end up finding that. Was there a door straight in front of me? See that door right there. That might have been the one that I unlocked with the, uh... Unlocking it, but it still says it's locked, so maybe not. There's a hardcore thing down here. The lock is released. Yep, so that's what it was. That's what you had to go up and fight Wesker. If you didn't find all the modisks, put them all on, find where you put them, and go up there and make sure you did that. Jill! Chris, you're okay! Glad oh. to see you are too. Anything on Wesker? We'll talk later. First, let's get going. Okay, well, we saved Chris as a uh, chill, so I guess the only thing left for me to do is get on, get the hell on out of here. Oh, Chris is gonna be with me? Coolio. I guess I could roam around for a bit. Nah. Okay, I'm gonna. I'll just see you at the boss fight then. Come on, let's go. Come on, come on, hurry! <laughs> that was just the both of us. Both of them are there. And then they're just waiting for us to go through here. So I guess until I actually... I wonder if you can go throughout the entire game again. So one of the things I was wondering is if I actually went back to the self-destruct thing. If like, there'd be a, a scene there, if I could do something, whatnot. I might still check that out, actually. Um, and the other thing was that the, the woman in chains, we never actually killed her. Really actually fought her, would be more precise. <laughs> I wonder... If something has say the same cutscene with Brad. Contact me now or just give me a sign. I repeat, this is your last chance. So if we didn't get the radio from the dude, or could we could we have gotten the radio the entire time? Like having both of them with me though. So hmm. second playthroughs are gonna be fun to do different things. I didn't fill up my inventory, did I? Okay, good. <laughs> Not like last time. Just that one little extra thing, so it's like the game's like, oh, you you made sure to have as much ammo and weapons and health items as possible? Well, 
Screw you! Minutes to detonation. Damn it! We're almost there! Jill, you just get in contact with Brad! No! We can make it. Jill, ladies first. Friss! Would you let me have my moments too? All right. We'll rendezvous at the heliport. What was chasing us? I'll try to, was it made the bug creatures? Because it was a pretty good screech. Uh, oh well. Alright, so we'll go up here, get the little briefcase, put it down. Fight the boss again, see what the ending's gonna be. Do, 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 Alright, so we're seeing this ending very again for the second time. It's very weird thing, like signal rockets. Is there anything up here? No, just a big open boss arena. Go to the center of it. Oh, and too bad I can't use the forklift. How many Resident Evils end like this? So this game ends like this. Four kind of ends like this. Five definitely does not end like this. Well, actually, you know what it kind of does? There's a helicopter involved. It's a... It's a kind of not necessarily on top of a volcano, but mm -hmm. in a volcano. Jill! You made it! I, he just still has a normal pistol. I'm not holding anything in my hands right now. Oh! Got taken out. Shoot him right in this big bump is hot. So this is all the same. So he's gonna- HOLY SHIT! Oh no. <laughs> oh. Oh, I, I know I'm shooting him. Oh, I'm dead. Oh. 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 Jill, than, use it! Use it Kill it, whatever it is! I thought he doesn't even... Oh! I don't know why, but just seeing like getting thrown across the entire screen is great to me. I was in a bad spot for that, though. Oh, God. This is a really bad spot. Oh, bye-bye, Barry. So now I need to equip it. Get away. I need to equip it and shoot it. And if he hits me, I'm dead. Oh, shoot! And there it goes. <laughs> get to watch this again. Okay, the straight magnum is not as good as the grenade launcher. I would, I did not expect that. Oh, another achievement. I'm a member of Stars, saving Chris Berry and using Jill. Okay, okay then. So we gotta play through the game again. And like not give Barry his gun, he'll probably die then. Is this really the only like I wonder all the little choices we made throughout the game, how much they matter. So watch everything looks fine. And then the explosion just looks doesn't belong. <laughs> wow, it's even more of I guess she all of her exhaustion gets let out, so she, she's relaxed and comfortable near Chris. So did Barry actually kill anyone? Obviously he's been working with Wesker. That's it, there's no even dialogue or anything. So are you gonna get a, even a talk about Barry and his kids? Okay then. Not even... <laughs> that ending doesn't seem as... Obviously... <laughs> I feel like well, there's a lot less in that ending than there was the one without Chris. Uh, all this stage right. Okay, let's see what my score is at the end. Jill, you did a fine job. Okay, well, Creatures Dispatch is the same. 23 ink ribbons, I think it might have been one of my last time. 25 health items. 282 bullets used. Okay then. Uh, is that it? features from prototype version well we already got all that 
Jill has a new costume. Start button. I I already have the clear data saved from last time. Does it matter? I I guess I'll keep both of them because now I have one with. I don't think it matters because they're both just clear saves. I wonder if I if I start a new game, do I get another thing of saves? I wonder how that's gonna work. <laughs> <laughs> or I can just have two last saves. And I noticed this. I didn't get a chance to talk about it, but the background changes. So it could, eyeballs staring at me. Once again, I wonder what that means. This looks like it went back to the original GameCube. Oh, there's a lot of stuff. Gallery. What is this? Movies. Opening. Locked. Why is everything locked? How come I only have ending Jill 1, ending Jill 3? And there's still a bunch of selected. Do I have to unlock them? How come they're all locked? Oh. <laughs> I only have like two Jill movies. Oh crap, I didn't want to watch that. So this is the ending. The a lot of Jurassic Park type ending. Uh credits, manual, options, real survivor. What's once again? Uh I gotta choose the game. Load my Okay, once again is start a new game. Okay then. That was incredibly fun. Little head scratching at times, but I love that a lot. Uh I wonder, maybe if I, the other ending is like they, Barry has to die also? Let's say the ending with just Barry, ending with Chris and Barry, and then an ending without either of them? Or maybe, I wonder if you can get rid of Barry and save Chris. I feel like you should be able to do that. So that's four options. Because you could definitely leave Chris behind. If you can kill Barry, then leave those behind. Oh god! Okay, tune in next time where we uh, start up as Chris. That's going to be fun. So, obviously the Chris campaign is going to be different, but shouldn't take as nearly as long, right? Because we've already played through the game, so I don't... Unless the puzzles are different, which they probably are, but eh, we'll, I don't know. We'll, see. we'll see. Thanks for watching, everybody. Peace. Mother-loving out.